Good morning, everybody. I'm speaking quietly because it is morning and I'm tired because last night I decided to have a midnight snack, which was really good and I really liked it so much so that I think I'm going to have that for breakfast, but it was at like 2 a.m. So um, that's not as good. It's like 9.30 now and yeah, I think I'm going to ha do something similar and I might cook an egg to make it more like hearty. I just did this with my hands to signify hearty. Today I'm going to be going to mass first in the morning and then I think I'm going to come back and Skype with my parents and then cook lunch and then head back over to campus to study at the library again because I have a my linguistics exam tomorrow and I haven't studied for that because I've been studying psych. Can we just talk about how gross our recycling is? We haven't taken it out in probably, I don't know, a month, three weeks. Look at all those Nutella containers. <laughs> so this is my breakfast. It's egg, tuna, tomato, and cheese somewhere in there. And on pita, which is really good. And Luke's here. This is Luke's cute pan that he got yesterday and it perfectly fits an egg and it's gonna be a perfect, perfectly circular egg. I'm such a horrible roommate. I have so many dishes I need to do, but I need to leave in 15 minutes to go to church. This is a thing that we do. This is me and filming it. It's not making me go any faster. But we write down all of the dishes. Wow, wow. If we can't wash our dishes right away, we write down all of the dishes that we use that we can't, that we didn't wash, so that we know which dishes to wash later and we'll wash them. Okay, so this outfit, it's like different than what I would usually wear on a regular day. I am wearing my fake glasses, which I'm gonna take off after the shot, but it looked nice in this outfit. So, aside from my scarf and my jacket, this isn't even my like proper winter jacket, so I might change this out. But I'm not going to be walking outside for too long, so I might use this one because my winter jacket is nice, but it's really warm and I don't see the need for it if I'm not going to walk long distances. But I'm wearing this turtleneck uh, purple shirt. Oh, it's bright, but like this is really bad quality filming, but that's the color of my shirt. And then I'm wearing like black mom jeans and I kind of cuffed it on the end and then I wore brown boots and honestly I'm digging the look these jeans I can't I never I'm never able to like wear these jeans properly with anything I just don't like the look of these jeans too much and I prefer like skinny jeans or like like light wash denim jeans that are mom jeans or boyfriend jeans fit you know what I mean and then pairing it with these boots kind of I'm digging it So here is the outside of the church, and if you didn't already notice, it's snowing! Yay! Oh, I'm also going to die walking up this hill. So I just got back from church, and I filmed like a short little clip of how it looks inside. That is St. Patrick's Basilica and it's super duper nice. Um, the mass today, it was in Latin or like all of the procedural parts. I don't know. So like not the readings and the gospel and the homily. Those ones were all in English, but everything else was in Latin. But on the way there and on the way back, I was knitting and I finished my mom's toque or beanie if you're not from Canada. And now I have to just sew it together, and I think it turned out pretty nice. Yeah, I'm excited to put this together. I'm gonna try to do that now without a crocheting needle? Hook, hook, crocheting hook. Which I should probably invest in because it makes things way easier when putting things together. But I don't have one right now, so I'm going to make it up and figure this out without that. <laughs> so instead of finishing my mom's hat, I decided to finish my hat. This is 
the first thing I fin like my first finished product ever in the history of the world even though I learned how to knit when I was like eight or seven I actually finished making this hat like I want to say like two months ago or like a month and a half ago but I just needed to like add on the pom-pom at the top and I never got around to doing it because it's a little bit harder and I don't know I just like wasn't in the mood anymore but now I finished it and I added the pom-pom and it's a little bit tight for my head um but I have a small head so it fits perfectly fine and I actually really like how it looks look at that Woo! here's how the hat looks uh when it's on my head so there's just a pom-pom here and this pom-pom isn't on that sturdy like I just used thread and kind of like went back and forth but the pom-pom is big enough that you don't really notice it and then at the bottom I just have it ribbed and folded over because I made it a little bit too long look at that I'm very proud of myself and I like the color combination so I'd actually wear it a lot if you haven't realized I love wearing toques because my hair is really I have a lot of hair like a lot of hair so if I don't have it tied up and it's just down like this it gets like in my face I always have to have my hair either tied back like this or like in a ponytail or whatever or I have a hat on so I always just opt for the hat because I'm just too so lazy to tie my hair sometimes and sometimes it's just way too knotted in all honesty Millie's a hipster today yeah I am mustache socks <laughs> in sandals Ooh. Oh, damn and then an oversized flannel that has a hood in the back that isn't mine and fake glasses and a homemade toque Ooh. wow what can be more hipster than that damn Damn! The lighting is terrible. You're terrible. I know. So I'm heading out again to campus and I'm just wearing my regular like white fake Adidas tennis shoes and I feel like I'm going to regret this. I'm going to slip and die or my ankles will freeze to death. Let's see which one it, it's gonna be. So far I'm actually not slipping which is good um, but my ankles are freezing. Not too bad yet, but enough for me to say so. In case you're interested, this is Sherbrooke right here, this road right here. Um, and this is downtown Montreal, more or less. And over here is the left side, I guess, of campus. Left side if you're facing campus like I am right now. This is McTavish and this road is mainly like pedestrian like there's that one car but you can see there's like pillars up ahead um and it's really really pretty and a lot of people like walk out here and hang out on here um during when it's not this cold like there's a lot of benches and stuff that people like to chill at this is the management building over here service point is over here and then the library is like up there I can't find my friends. I found them. They're not where they were supposed to be. Two updates. I am heading to, well, technically I'm heading back home from the library. I was semi-productive, but not really productive. Um, and I'm going to go drop by the mall to go to IGA and Pharmaprix, AKA Shoppers, if you're not from Quebec, uh, to pick up some stuff. But aside from that, uh, sneakers update, I have, almost fallen and slipped like a billion times oh i almost slipped there grip is not g green light whoa it is not green this is so weird ankles are also cold as expected <laughs> but i mean like my hands are cold too everything's cold so whatever it's been a while since i vlogged um i went to the grocery store and did all that stuff um, and then I was kind of in a bad mood because I couldn't find all the stuff that I needed to get and I was just really tired and kind of annoyed at myself for spending money and also not studying as much as I should have. And then Luke and I watched Star Wars. Well, we finished it. I don't know if I said it yesterday, but basically we've been watching like kind of little bits and pieces of Star Wars, the fourth episode, aka like the very first one that came out because I haven't watched it before. We didn't really get that far into the movie before something would have to happen. Usually it's me like getting too sleepy and falling asleep. But then we finally finished the first 
episode, first episode, fourth episode, technically, first movie. Um, and now I'm running a little bit late to going back to campus because I'm going to do some studying there. Um, if you haven't realized, I am way more productive when I am on campus at the library. Sometimes I'm, I'm uh, productive when I'm at home on my, at my desk. But then if I want to be studying with people, it has to be like at the library or at a cafe. But then when I'm at a cafe or Starbucks, I need to like buy stuff. So not really down for that. So I'm heading back and Rachel and I are probably going to chill there for a while until like 12, 1230. I don't really know. Something like that. <sighs> Why am I out of breath? I am very much borderline screwed for my exam tomorrow. But it's not too important that I get a high mark in that class. Here's to me not wanting to be a perfectionist and wanting to always attain high grades when I don't need to. Because uh, there's more to life that's important.